Hello, my collective. I'm so glad that I have a bunch of supporters for the um, Tuesday at 2222 p.m. Okay. I don't know what, what was going on. I just channeled 222 on a Tuesday. So let's try to get more views and more comments on that video and then more energy, right? And then I will set a date and we can agree upon, see if everybody is agreeing upon Tuesday on whatever Tuesday that I, I will choose. Because, you know, people have schedules, kids, things to do, right? So let's see what comes up for our twin flames, divine masculine, divine feminines. What is the overall feeling, energy? Collectively for our twin flames. Some cards may resonate. Some may not. This will be instead of a channeled message. It will be a general collective for twin flames. So if one card comes out and says. I'm glad we just communicated. And y'all didn't communicate. That part's not for you. Right. Don't make for stories fit. Not on this channel we don't. We get to the nitty gritty. We get to the truth so we can know what to heal, fix, and move forward from, right? So let's see. How does our twin flames feel collectively right now? Collectively. Okay, for some of you, I would do it all over again. For some, I would not. Some of you guys' twin flames are literally running. Yep, look at that. I don't know... I don't want to know. They don't want to know what, spirit? What don't they want to know? You broke my heart. I don't want to know the pain. It's like, look, this is why some of them won't do it again. <laughs> They're not doing it again because they don't want to know the pain. They don't want to know the pain, okay? Awful, some of you. I feel so happy with you. Okay. Collectively, what's twin flames here? Some of you will be getting a call, text, email, whatever. I just called to say I love you. Fairly soon is what I'm hearing because I can't keep it hand in anymore. My guide said I need you. Didn't that card come out earlier? So what I'm getting from this is a bunch of twin flames are spiritually waking up. Because the world is shifting, right? Look, bam, I'm listening to my intuition. Look, the world is shifting and I'm listening to my intuition. Ooh, I surrender to you to the divine. I surrender. I love you and I do not know why. What I'm getting from this card is I surrender you to the divine is basically I surrender this connection to the divine i surrender you to the divine so this can come back to me and i trust i trust that what i'm wanting and channeling will come when it's supposed to come look some of you give me a second chance and i just want to kiss you okay interesting twin flames is the energy is everywhere because some of our twin flames are awakening up some of the other twin flames are still stuck, right? I don't react when people mention you. People can mention you and they'll just sit there and be like, oh, I haven't talked to her. I haven't talked to him. It is what it is. Then boom, change the subject. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. And it's the reason why they don't react because it was really hard to let you go. I definitely replay conversations over and over and over into my mind. Damn, where did I fuck up? Where did I go wrong? What did I do to make this situation better? What do I do to make this situation worse? What did I do, period, right? Let's get some overall cards for Twin Flames. Where, what stages are my Twin Flames in, Spirit? I heard Runner and Chaser, of course. Let's see. Some of you are in this very successful stage of your Twin Flames, okay? Very successful stage at the bottom of the deck, learning to cope, learning to be without, learning to heal from codependencies, learning to heal. It's a very successful stage. Yes, it's a victory. 
some some of the some of you guys are stagnant, right? Not moving or, or maybe a little insecure over this victory because it's not coming in as fast as it should be. But I think with time and money, a lot of divine masculines need their money. Okay, remember how I said that nothing is right if their money is not right. They they don't they feel lost. They feel without. They feel like how can I go for love if I don't have money? Okay, um, time. This is giving me time. Someone still needing time. Someone reminiscing on time. I feel like a lot of us are in a very successful stage of our twin flame ship. It's just you feel it in the air. Look, when you feel your connection with your person, you do not, not feel it. Okay? You don't even have to question it. The way they look at you, the way they text you, the way that you know they're stalking you on your fucking social media and shit. You know that this person is changing. Okay? And staying committed and determined to the love, the 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 unionship, the getting through. Okay, flip it out there. Getting through the, the codependencies and holding on to materialistic shit. So karma, look, karma is right on top of karma. So karma, justice can write itself and complete these cycles. I think this is really good for Twin Flames. I really do. The energy is like immaculate. Like I know some of you guys feel it. If you question if your Twin Flame is healing... It's not, this story is not for you. Because you know damn well. You can doubt it a little bit. Like, am I tripping? Or did he just really say something that he's never said before? Or is he really acting how he's never acted before? I'm telling you, you can feel it. You can see it. You're not going to question it. You're going to know, right? There's a very enthusiastic energy. Keeping the torch hot. Keeping the wand carried. Why am I getting making the world go around? Because that looks like a world right now. Nine of Pentacles, abundant, successful. What is this page of wands, spirit? Deciding. Deciding to complete these cycles. Deci deciding to make the world go around. Deciding that just because there was a death doesn't mean that there wasn't going to be a rebirth. Deciding that just because you were sad at that moment doesn't mean you wasn't going to step into your king of swords for your fucking family at the end of the day. Period. Spirit. Yes. Deciding and holding this enthusiasm for this death and this rebirth. This is very much enthusiastic vibes. Very much childlike. Very much, this is something new to me, but I'm going to pursue it. Very much, I'm ready. I'm surrendering, right, to the death and rebirth. Because everybody tired of feeling like this. Whether your person is a twin flame runner, chaser, or a karmic, we're all tired of feeling like that. We want to know what's, 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 what's next, okay? We want to know what's the next step in, in this process of the twin flames. Or if it's a karmic, what's the next process? How can I cut this bullshit out, Okay. How can I get to my family if it is a karmic? Because this, this karmic that I was messing with was making me not plan how I was supposed to plan and not work hard at what I was supposed to work hard at within seeking the answers within myself. Look at that. Karmics are distractions, right? Karmics are here for your downfall. Karmics were making you not plan and work as hard as what you were supposed to do to get to the inner self to feel complete. And that's just facts. To get to the also the pinnacle is what I'm getting. Okay, seven of wands stood your ground, defensive as hell, coming into your own queen of cups. Okay, to fulfill yourself with these karmics because you know, <laughs> spirit said, and then it is there, and then it is there because you know. Thank you for watching the high priestess tarot. Click that like button and thank you guys. Look out for the, 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 the correct Tuesday. For when we're going to all manifest together. This card is not supposed to be in there. But guess what? Spirit said I'm healing for codependencies. And that's why it's not supposed to be in there. Mm. Because guess what? I couldn't let you go. I couldn't let you either. Well, I've seen I couldn't let you go. But honestly, I couldn't let you get close to me. And that is because I am healing from codependencies. And y'all know when I get into rhyming, shit getting into hymen. Oh, period. Hymen ain't a word. It's a word, but we're going to use it today. It ain't what it's supposed to be used for, but it's uh, hymen and rhyming and chiming, bitch. <laughs> Look, okay, I'm a, I'm a favorite saying, now you know when I get into rhyming, shit getting the chiming, because ding, 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 period.